Mapping Transformational Skills for Human Capital. This is a website where you pay money to work for a company as a, an internship. Now this is in the UK, so people of the UK that watch this channel, can you guys just give me some input on this? Uh, is this normal? Like paying for a micro internship? 99 pounds for a remote internship, 300 pounds, a hybrid internship, 600 pounds. And then at the bottom here, you can just add on how many credit hours you want. Is this legal? Can you do that? Is this considered a scam in the UK? I'm not sure, but basically just buying your credit hours seems like something you shouldn't be able to do. Paying money to work for someone also doesn't seem like something that you should do. This entire website talks about how they match you with some internship that's going to be perfect for your skill set but they don't ever show any of the things that you'll be doing or any of the companies that you'll be working for they have a youtube channel um, what they do there meet with our interns and uh, let me let me play a little video so you can see what it's like to pay money to do a, a chip coup internship hi everyone welcome to this video my name is arjun and i'm a web developer intern at chip coup labs in this video, I'll be showing you what it's like to work at Chipku Labs and what kind of activities you can expect to be doing. Let me pause here. He keeps talking about Chipku Labs. It's the second company of Chipku. So pick a plan here. And then you can work for, I guess, their subsidiary company, Chipku Lab. Uh, what they make you do is work on the actual Chipku website. So it's interns paying money to work on a site that you can buy internships at. Anyways, let me play the video some more. First thing I had to do today was attend a meeting with my manager where she told me the things I need to be doing for the day. And one of them is draft emails for our subscribers and host companies. And uh, straight off that I have to update the website by adding new reviews and adding a blog post as well. So I've pretty much done the web development um, task that we do for today. That. What he did was work on the testimonials page, which you can see here, which is an entire meme in and of itself. When like they do, and this is what he was working on. So he paid money to be an intern, and then his internship job was to make this page for selling internships to other interns. It's like a giant, I don't want to call it a scam, but I, like, is this a thing in the UK? Here's another one where this kid talks about what he does here. And he also, his tasks are to basically make this website. I think today I'm going to be working on making some social media posts and uh, publishing some uh, blogs this morning. This is a day in the life of an intern for their virtual internship program. How much? So this, this kid paid 300 pounds to do blog posts for this company. Oh, and then he makes some blog posts and which he goes to this website here. Students look ahead to summer amid shifting conditions. And then this is Chipku's medium copied and pasted the title, talk about some stuff, and then they link it down here. So I spent a little bit longer than uh, expected working on those blog posts. I've made jokes before on this channel about companies building their entire company off of interns. Not only are these interns unpaid, like they're not making any money, but they paid money to build this website. Let me show you who is responsible for this website. This guy right here, Chipku Labs, was founded by Rahan graduated from high school with amazing grades. Really weird. People close to him influenced him to pursue engineering while he wanted to study business. He eventually pursued information technology and later cybersecurity, ultimately excelling as a cybersecurity professional after a rigorous journey. However, he realized that many young professionals could deal better with career obstacles if they have access to the right mentorship and skills development at the beginning of their career. This was the catalyst for creating Chipku Platform. This is their leadership. Bunch of randos, like here's a basic typo stuff. She is an accomplished marketing specialist. Accomplished marketing, one word. Um, here, here's the Rahan guy talking about himself in third person again. A tenacious thought leader. You ever heard of this guy? Didn't think so. Expert with 15 plus years of global strategic and operational leadership delivering holistic view of transformation and business aligned cybersecurity solutions. That's why you can pay this man money to build chipku.com. Here's another video of uh, a day in the life of one of their Chipku interns. So I started at 10 a.m. today. Um, I actually clocked on a bit earlier today because I had to reply to some emails. 
get back to my colleague. Keep in mind, when she says, I have to get back to my colleague, she's referring to other interns, other people who paid money to work at Chipku Labs to build Chipku.com. I actually went on to our Instagram page and last week I created some content. Wrote a nice caption there, put my hashtags in and I posted it. She paid money to post Instagram content for someone else. Do schools really accept this as an internship? Does this really count? Does this really give you academic credit? Well, I guess according to them, it's just like a checkout form. How many credit hours do I need to finish? All right, let's add that on to the package here. This is a joke, dude. Like related products. Other customers bought this as well. It's like Amazon. What do you even get for this? Career employability mentoring and coach Allop assessments for corporate recruitment. Collaborative working in global teams. Career readiness toolkits. There's nothing about career readiness toolkits on this website. Access to powerful network. That's right, you get access to this this guy. He is a he's a thought leader. Intern with popular brands or giants. Global internship curriculum, task-based learning, global employability certificate, job dynamics, and hardcore preparation. Hardcore preparation, I don't know. Uh, that doesn't seem safe for work. Workshop career education and startup fairs. Paid plus goodies plus stipends. So you're saying unless you pay for the most expensive internship, you're not going to get paid. Further industry placement guaranteed recruitment academic credit. So what do we get if we get a cheaper one? Okay, so you don't get paid. If you if you buy the $343 one, you don't get it. You don't get paid to do this job. You do get a work reference though. Let me show you some of the testimonials. There's actually copied and pasted reviews on here. Like this guy, right? At first I thought I won't really participate and just use this as a shortcut for the certificate. The site is a bunch of kids trying to cheat their way through college. And then I said, you know, let me join at least one class, the first class. Then I joined and I was surprised at how interested they were in us, how they reviewed each person's assignment and what to do better. Why would you let someone like this review your website? At first I thought I was just gonna use it to cheat. But then I joined one class, and they were really interested in me. And so not only is there this review, it's copied and pasted down here. At first I thought I won't really participate, and just use shortcut for the certificate. And then I said, let me join at least one class. The time schedule was on point, always on time. Did I read that? The time schedule was on point, always on time. <sighs> Bars. No, they're fake. They're, these are definitely fake. It's really sad because people are buying this thinking that they're gonna get something out of it. From the looks of it, they all just build this website. They paid money to build this website and this entire company is built off of the back of interns. They also charge money for resume services. They have expert specialist in ACE, whatever that means. They have a, a bunch of links about partnerships, but they're actually not really partnered with anyone. They have a sign up and login page built on WordPress. I thought that was interesting. Uh, we have this guy pursued information technology and cyber cybersecurity. And so as a cybersecurity professional, he has chosen WordPress, one of the most security flawed platforms there is to host his state of the art company. They have a podcast, which is interesting. What you've done and what are your accomplishments? And that's another crucial aspect that you need to portray on LinkedIn. Exactly, it makes sense, Yamna. And um, I think um, you should use a professional profile picture and that hurts my ears to listen to. Like, what is this? But that was just an idea that I'm gonna show to my manager now. I'm gonna send it over to her, see what she thinks. Um, hopefully we can upload that and get loads of them going throughout the week. Um, but now I have to just edit this video that I'm making now and then I'm done for the day. There's internships available for literally anything you could ever wanna do. Apparently this tiny little team here of these people know everyone in every single industry. They have a one day internship. I don't know what they're charging for it. Participate and unlock the limited edition for virtual internship programs. Only 300 pounds. Wow. But yeah, I mean, what are you going to do with a one-day internship? The description is hilarious. One-day internship is a once-a-month lifetime opportunity to experience the fast-paced, out-of-the-box life at UK's leading startups for one whole day. Open to one and all students, working professionals, freelancers, academic... Academicians? Academicans. Ac ac Am I reading this right? Academic, academicians? There's an I A A C A D E M I C I A N S. Academicians. Dropouts. <laughs> Clearly the person who wrote this. And everyone else. Access international companies anywhere, anytime. And these are the companies that you can work at, uh, I guess, for a day. Maple Green, Litopia, Bubbleology. They have a um, highlights reel. <laughs> So 
bad. The music just starts over in the middle of another song that they just introduced. I don't know. I found this site uh, interesting. I posted it to my Discord and I said, does this seem legitimate? And they said, wait, what? So uh, I decided to make a video on it and I, I'm going to ask you guys the same question. Does this seem legitimate, especially people in the UK? Anyways, that's all I got for this video. Leave a like if you want to see more content of me tearing apart the corporate world or even college cringe these days because that's what this is. And uh, leave a comment. Let me know what you think. If you have any content you'd like me to showcase on this channel, I have a Discord, email, Instagram DMs, whatever you want. Happy to showcase it. Thanks so much. See you in the next one.